What's going on guys? It's a reg mother flipping G here with another video. You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? Today, today is the day I've been waiting for. Head up. Uh, this is what we got for today. Ooh, hold up, hold up, hold up. Damn, bro, bro. I've been waiting for this. <laughs> yeah, guys, uh, we're gonna be installing these today. These are these are energy bucket seats. Um, reason being, because they look cooler, and because these are torn to shit. You know what I'm saying? Look at that. God damn, looks like a sushi came in here and ripped it all up. But uh, yeah, we're gonna be installing these and uh, taking these out. Uh, that one's not that bad. It just has that rip. But this, this is bad. Yeah, guys. First off, uh, we're gonna be taking these four bolts. This one, this one, and then there's two back ones. Uh, we're gonna be taking those bolts out uh, with a 14 millimeter. Damn, this thing is dirty. Let's throw this away. This is my dodo sheet. Oh shit. Um, yeah, guys. I'm gonna vacuum this up real quick because this thing is not nice. And you guys may be wondering, is he selling the seats? Yes, I am. 500 for the pair. I know what I got. Um, to the girl from Bissonnet that uh, that I picked up the other day, I uh, have your lip balm. Yeah, so I cool. All right, guys. So I got it all vacuumed up. Uh, try to do the best I can. You know what I'm saying? Get it all clean. So now. Trying to put those bad boys on here. Alrighty guys, so I got this one in. Um, it took me a little bit. I had to adjust it. Um, reason being, um, the guy I bought it from, uh, he gave me the rails for free. Uh, but I don't know why. Uh, I feel like I know why. But uh, it's because uh, the railings, uh, he like, they didn't fit. He was telling me they didn't fit right. So what he did is uh, him and his dad uh, they, like customized it. I don't know. Uh, they like engineered it, he said. They like engineered it into the, the rail. They made, I don't know what they did, but those three bolts are gonna be able to uh, bolt on. Uh, that back one down there, uh, it's not lining up, but uh, it should be fine. That's how I had the other one actually. I had uh, the passenger on one bolt because, well, missing one bolt because, uh, um, whatchamacallit, I lost it. So, alrighty guys, so I just finished installing um, the seats. Um, I can only use three bolts on both of them. Uh, reason being, I saw where he said the guy that I bought it from he said he like made like custom rails. It's like a plate that he put on and it like, it's like touching against the thing, but screw it, it's not moving, you see? They don't move at all, because they're all the way back. But here you go, guys. Oh shit, I almost fell. Uh, man, these things are good. I'm not gonna lie. I actually sit up, I think I sit a little higher. So, I never sat on the passenger side, but I think I sit higher. So you can see I'm almost touching the freaking ceiling. But that's fine. <sighs> I'm never sitting here anyway. <laughs> but yeah, actually, um, now that I got these on, what we're gonna go do next is I'm gonna go to this like stereo place. Um, I'm gonna go get them to check out what's wrong with uh, the radio, why isn't that working? But yeah, guys, um, I'll let you guys know what happens when we're there. All right, guys, so I just got done at the radio stereo place. Um, bro, okay, so apparently the speakers do work, they both work, but they say that it's, uh, probably the radio itself like this thing is probably like messed up already where the aux goes yeah I know it's freaking old so um I think I'm gonna just buy another one like a Bluetooth one like the one that the Subaru has what's up guys so right now we're actually heading to uh, Bomberino's house uh, he's gonna help me um, fix this little leak uh, the valve cover has uh, don't ask why I'll explain it right now but yeah uh, I'm about to meet up with him right now I know it's dark uh, hopefully we got like a light or something yeah, but I'll get back to you guys when I'm with him. He should be pulling up uh, soon. When, he should be there when I get there. So uh, I'll hit you guys back up when we're there. 
What's up, guys? So I'm right here with Tito El Bomberino. You know uh, what I mean, Jelly Bean? <laughs> what? This guy. Tito Bomberino. Tito El Bomberino, bro. Uh, but yeah, he's gonna help us out because uh, right here, as you can see, it's uh, whenever I took the the little loop thing off when I was changing the cast overing, um, I accidentally yanked it out. I yanked it out, and uh, it took the ceiling with it. Uh, so you I'm, what? So you what? Uh, what you do? Kind of messed up. <laughs> Nah, it's because uh, I was on a rush to go to my Tinder date. But yeah, we're gonna get that fixed today. And uh, I'm gonna show you guys. I really didn't go on Tinder. <laughs> real quick, guys, just, I'm gonna just explain it real quick. Uh, what you gotta do is uh, just get a 10 mil and then just take all these screws off. Uh, we're gonna have to unplug the spark plugs real quick and then that PCB valve, but. Don't be scared, just fucking pull on them, man. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, but uh, yeah, we're gonna do that right now. One, one thing don't do is don't unplug them from right here. You know, this is one, two, three, four, and then obviously the long one's gonna go right here. You don't fucking put the long one right there. You're starting to start getting misfires everywhere. All right, guys, so we unscrewed all the screws. Uh, I forgot to tell you guys, you gotta take this hose off and the PCB hose off. And uh, there's two 12 mils right here and on the other side. Don't don't break the PCB hose. Oh yeah, don't break it like I don't know Bomberino did right here. Look, look, number. Hey man, I got too much strength. You know what I'm saying? Oh there Shit. it is. Yeah, there you go. See right what we're fucking looking for. <laughs> but look, once once you have everything loose, I got a pry bar, but you can use a flathead. Just put it right here, and it'll, it'll pop up. Stop. Stop. Easy. Sas. There you go. Sas. 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 Alrighty guys, so the sealant we're using is this one called Permatex Right Stuff. Uh, this one's the good one because uh, it dries faster. So, alrighty guys, so we just put the sealant on all six corners. I want to say it was one, one, two, three, and four. And then, Come on, Reg, you know how to count. <laughs> five and six. And, uh, uh, we're putting on the valve cover. Ah, valve cover. Valve cover right now. So, yeah. the gasket's on there. We got the gasket. I don't know if y'all can see, but. I put ceiling on the gasket so it doesn't fall out whenever you have it like this. It ain't falling out, so. Pinche dumb guys, come hit him up. But yeah, guys, if you're in the Dallas, uh, Dallas Fort Worth area, hit up my boy, Bomberino. He's the one that sponsored me. I said it the last video. Uh, I'll put his Instagram down below. Uh, I think I did the last video also. Uh, just hit him up. He does anything uh, from stuff like this uh, to. Shit. Uh, Show my car. Just show oh, my car. Oh, for real. Oh, I was gonna. I was about to show the car. Look, <laughs> right. Look at this hoe. Everything on that car, I did. Like that. Self-made head ass. <laughs> just hit him up. Uh, just ask him, and uh, he'll let you know. All right, guys. So um, we're just tightening it down. I suggest you guys use a torque wrench. So that way, um, it can be right. Uh, but the torque spec for it is if you're using inch pounds. It's uh, 55 inch pounds, or if you're using foot pounds, uh, it's uh, five or six foot pounds. So, uh, all right. So look, take a look at this. So it's already torqued to spec, but when it's tight, you hear a click. So that's that's the way it's supposed to be tightened. Y'all don't don't keep cranking on it whenever. Y'all saw y'all snap. Yeah, y'all gonna mess Most it up. like this, like somebody did. He's just trying to flame. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty guys, so we got everything torqued to be ready to go, but we're gonna go get this uh, PCB valve because uh, we kind of messed up. But <laughs> well, I fucked it up. Just, just, pulling on it. Oh shit! Got my mess. I've never been in this hole. <laughs> we got hella switches and shit. That's for the knots. Ching. <laughs> <laughs> got the got six bottles under your seat. Are you wish? <laughs> how fucking steep this is. Right. Like if I go straight out. Uh, That's why I'm at an angle right now. Yeah, if I go straight out, I'm free. You know what I'm saying? Oh, my man. That's the frame just banging. Oh. Look how much he's gonna make me waste, bro. I swear to God. 
Come on, focus. Yeah, bruh. That's two Jack tacos at fucking Jack, bruh. No, my miss. Look at this guy. He's lower than me. He's gonna go over these speed bumps. Ooh. Watch this. Ah, oh, damn. Oh, shit. <laughs> bruh. <laughs> well, the thing is, is, I know what's creeping. Yeah, what is it? I'm in the back bumper. <laughs> that guy was just looking. Oh shit, you're going straight. Ooh. God damn. <laughs> this, one, this one right here is the worst one. Oh yeah, nah, I go, I go right. I, nah, I saw that fucking, dip. Nah, you fucking up going on the right. That's Hell no. Nah. That's where it gets higher. No, no, I mean like, I go left to right. Nah, all right, here, watch. Bruh. <laughs> Damn, nah, nah, I didn't even scrape when I went over Alrighty guys, so I wasn't able to film an outro, you know, it was a bomberino, but uh, just hope you guys enjoyed, uh, leave a comment, like, and subscribe, and uh, suck my ass.